So hi and welcome back to part two of this series on how to make your own DNS, I mean uh, your own uh, extension, sort of like AS.vc using uh, Bind and Ubuntu. So uh, the last video we left off uh, having just installed uh, the Bind DNS server. So in this video what we're going to do is we're going to start setting it up. So what we're going to do is we're going to set cd to change directory into the slash etc slash bind uh, directory and we hit enter. So this, if we type ls, this will list all the files in the directory. And what we want to do is we want to edit the file named.conf.local. So I'm just going to copy that name and I'm going to uh, say nano, which is the text editor I want to use, and I'm just going to paste in the name of the file. So this loads up the file and we can uh, edit it and put in our configuration for our uh, domain here. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a new zone. So we're going to say zone. Um, we're going to say zone and then we put in the name of the domain in uh, to uh, double quotes. So what I'm going to say is tld.howcode.org. Then what we want to do is we want to put two curly brackets uh, in to surround, uh, or I mean to open and close the zone. So everything in here is where we're going to put the information for our zone file. So what we want to type here is, uh, we're just going to indent it a bit. I'm just going to say type master. Then we're going to go down a line and we're going to type in. So uh, what we're going to type in here is the location of the zone file for the um, the domain. So this is basically sort of a reference to the uh, zone file. And what we're going to do is we're going to put in the file where the zone is actually stored. So we just put in the word file and we give it uh, the uh, file uh, location. And we need a semicolon at the end of it. So what we're going to say is slash etc slash bind slash zones slash um, tld.howcode.org.zone. The file name and the location is just uh, up to you. You can put you can put the file wherever you want and you can call it whatever you want. But I'm just going to call it this for uh, simplicity. The next thing we need is we need the reverse DNS zone, which is uh, another zone we create and we uh, reference the reverse DNS zone. So what reverse DNS is is um it's the opposite of DNS. So DNS works by you give it a host name and it can resolve the IP address of the server. And what reverse DNS does is you give it the IP address of the server and it can find the host name. So we uh, again put in the zone and we uh, create the new zone here. And then here, instead of putting in a domain name, we put in uh, the IP address. But it's sort of weird. It's not the actual um, IP address that you would, uh, it's not the actual IP address we put in. So when I say it's not the actual IP address, uh, it's actually just the IP address backwards, which is uh, which is actually a bit weird. So what I'm just going to paste in is the IP address of the server here, and I'm going to show you uh, how to put in the reverse DNS. So what we do is we type in 228.23.243.162. In my case, in your case, I'll obviously have a different uh, IP address. Then we type in the word dot in uh, dash a d d r dot arpa so just ignore the rest but that's just uh, required to make it actually work and now, now we've got the IP address in we need to delete it so a quick thing you can do is you can uh, instead of deleting the whole thing you can just press control K at the end of the line and it'll remove the whole line uh, if you're using nano and again we just do the same thing we say type master uh, file and we give it the location of the reverse DNS file so I'm, or the reverse DNS zone so I'm going to say bind zones uh, and then just the same thing again, so I'll just copy this and paste it in, and we'll say dot zone at the end of it. Actually, now we'll get rid of it because it just overcomplicates things, putting too many dots in. So, uh, whoops, we have an F over here, so we need to uh, get rid of it. So just get rid of the F, and let's click, uh, click Control X, and then hit Y, and then hit uh, Enter to save the file. So we've just set up the uh, well the references to the zone files in our uh, bind DNS server. So that's it for this video. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.